As a scientist working with biotechnology, I know the scientific side, all the advantages and possibilities. As a mother, I can say that I feel very safe with biotechnology. I have great faith in this technology. We will have products that will benefit my health, my daughter's health, and the health of the environment where I live. We have many products being developed in Brazil. Besides soy, we have corn, papaya, beans, potato, sugar cane, we have eucalyptus, rice, passion fruit, orange and lemon. These products are tested. They are tested from the beginning in the lab, from the moment the gene is isolated. Then the gene is transferred to the plant and the plant is analyzed to see if the gene expresses properly, if the protein we wanted to express is working and if they are safe for human health and the environment. After that, this plant goes to a greenhouse where it is analyzed agronomically. Does it grow well? Is the goal we had with the transgenic plant being reached? Then these plants go to the field. Small experimental areas, both for agronomic analysis and environmental analysis. If the plant will be used as food, all tests for allergies and toxicity are done. And only when we are sure that a product will not cause any problems can it go to the market. The testing is much stricter than for conventional foods. People are afraid of everything that is new. Each new technology that was created brought apprehension at first. This is natural. Nothing has zero risk. So you can't tell me there should be zero risk with biotechnology or any other technology for that matter. Using biotechnology throughout the world, as far as I know, has not brought any significant problems. So the risk lies in not using biotechnology, in not utilizing the benefits for both the environment and society, in not using science to solve our problems of hunger, malnutrition, and hospitable areas where it's difficult to farm. The world needs to evolve, the population grows, and we need to have science and technology to keep up and bring benefits.